BMW 3E46 is a desirable object for many motorists. Someone loves the 3 for an aggressive and balanced appearance, someone for technical characteristics. Of course, there is something to love for, but how much will such affection cost? Age and operating characteristics leave their marks even on a well-designed car. Is it possible now to find a copy in a living state? Let's figure it out. BMW 3 has a complete set of bodies, sedan, coupe, station wagon, convertible, and even a budget compact that few people like. The first three are easy to find in our area. They rot moderately, mainly due to age and physical damage. There are special places worth checking out before buying. The bottom of the door is in a circle. Wheel arches, especially if wide tires are installed and dirt with pebbles sandblasts the edges of the arches. Front shock absorber cups, be sure to check. When driving for a long time on a killed suspension on our roads, they come off the body. And the VIN number is stamped on the right cup, so with traces of welding work, you risk not registering the car. Junction of the rear subframe with the body. A problem that the manufacturer tried to fix after restyling, but it didn't work out to the end. After 2001, brakes are less common, but still do occur. The BMW 3E46 battery is located on the right in the trunk and some owners forget to put on a fumes pipe. This contributes to the accelerated occurrence of corrosion. At the same time, do not forget to check the terminals. The positive on the 3 rubles is special, it shoots back in case of a serious accident in order to de-energize the car. If the terminal turns out to be ordinary, then this is an occasion to think about the emergency past of such an instance. The base will already have air conditioning, front power windows and disc brakes all around. The driver will be comfortable in all respects. Ergonomics, seats, front panel position, everything was designed for him. The list of additional equipment is pretty standard, climate control, rain light sensors, electric seat and mirror adjustments. In the secondary market, these options do not particularly affect the price, the engine, year and general condition are of greater importance. Electrical systems there are many reasons for possible concern, but most of them are eliminated anemically. If desired, many breakdowns can be sorted out and eliminated on their own, especially since all topics have already been sucked on the internet. The comfort unit is responsible for the electrical adjustment of the sunroof, windows, and mirrors. It is not necessary to change it as an assembly, it is enough to replace individual relays or clean the contacts. With climate control glitches, do not rush to change the control unit. Sometimes, it is enough to disassemble it and clean the internal elements from dust. Namely, a temperature sensor and a fan, which is located inside the unit. It is also desirable to lubricate the fan axis. More trouble can bring the wiring itself, especially under the hood. Damage is extremely difficult to find, and because of them, various sensors begin to fail including those responsible for the operation of the cooling system fan, and this is already fraught with overheating of the engine. A little headache can bring banal ignition keys. They are equipped with an immobilizer, which is powered by a built-in battery that is charged while the key is in the ignition. Over time, the battery capacity drops, and after a two-hour walk, you may no longer open the car with the button. Painless battery replacement is not provided, it is necessary to unravel the old building and transfer all the stuffing to the new one. After that, you need another special initialization procedure. The new car was supposed to have three regular keys and two with an immobilizer. The presence of the latter is mandatory when buying. Petrol engine's favorite section of beamers. Moreover, engines were installed on the E46 with an eye to reliability. Chain motors with cast iron blocks or sleeves can last 250 plus thousand km without any complaints. But there are exceptions, let's look at them in order. 316i, 318i Unlike the previous generation, the designation 316 does not mean at all that a 1.6 liter engine is installed. There are several options. Before restyling. M43 TUB16, really a 1.6 engine with a capacity of 102 liters S, but they put it only on compact and only a few first years of production. 
M43TUB19, the same 8-valve engine, only 1.9 liters on the 316i they put 105 horsepower, and on the 318i have 118 horsepower, with. After August 2001. N42B18, not a very successful updated engine, 1.8 liters. Based on the N42B20, only with a short stroke crankshaft. Installed on E46316i. N42B20, a 2 liter big brother with a capacity of 143 horsepower and with the same problems. The main one is an increased risk of overheating. A clogged radiator and an unreliable thermostat contribute to this. Increased noise during engine operation is usually associated with the timing unit. If the engine is loud and diesel running, then you will have to at least change the chain tensioner and possibly the chain itself. The 318s were equipped with such engines. N46B20 to modified N42, which appeared after 2003. There were quite a few technical changes, but this did not affect the overall reliability but the power has grown to 150 forces. Above in the line of confusion, a little less. Starting with the 320th Troika, only inline six-cylinder engines were installed. During the release period of the E46, two generations managed to change them M52TU and M54. 320i's before restyling, they were equipped with a 2-liter M52 TUB20 with a capacity of 150 liters width. Such a motor already allows you to enjoy the wonderful handling of the Troika. In this case, you do not have to worry too much about reliability. Cast iron sleeves and double vanos serve 300 plus thousand km of run without much effort. With a human attitude to car maintenance, of course. After restyling in 2001, the motor was replaced with an improved M54B22. The volume increased by 200 cubes and the power increased to 170 horsepower, with reliability after improvements by engineers was not affected. 323i's the pre-styling M52TUB25 produced only 170 horsepower, s. Yes. After M54B25, he built up muscles and, with the same volume, has a power of 192 liters width. In connection with such changes, the nameplate on the trunk has changed to 325i. 328i, 330i is the same situation with the top engines of the line. The 2.8 liter, 193 horsepower M52 TUB28 was replaced by the 3 liter M54B30 with a herd of 231 horses. All the main and general problems with BMW 3 engines in the E46 body can be fit into a few points. 1. Cooling system. Be sure to clean the radiators at least once every 50,000 kilometers. Change the thermostat only to the original one and preferably for prevention once every 100,000 kilometers. Do not use a pump with a plastic impeller. 2. Engine oil must not be poured thoughtlessly. When using bad oil, oil channels, hydraulic lifters, and piston rings coat. And maintenance must be done at least once every 10 to 15,000 km. The oil must comply with the special BMW approvals. 1. For M43TU, M52TU, and M54 BMW Longlift 01 or Longlift 98. 2. For N42 and N46 BMW Longlift 01 or LL01FE. 3. N-Series Engines Higher operating temperatures cause problems more often than M-Series. Diesel engines are a good option to save on fuel, but the older the car, the more risky such a purchase. Savings can turn into very large costs for repairing the fuel system. Only two diesel engines were installed on the E46, M47, and M57. But, traditionally, each of them has modifications. 318D equipped with the smallest M47 D20, 115 horsepower, with. But consumption in the region of 6 liters of diesel fuel in the city. 320D more interesting modifications have already been installed, 136 horsepower, with before restyling, and a modified 150 horsepower M47 TUD20 after 2001. The main modernization was the fuel system since 2001 common rail. 
and the turbocharger began to be controlled by electronics. 330D inline and six-cylinder, as befits a BMW. Most of the time, the M57 D30 was produced with a power of 184 forces. Only on the BMW 3E46 after 2003 was the M57 TUD30 installed, which could already compete with the top-end gasoline engine. Especially at the start, due to the excellent traction from the bottom. Officially, diesel E46S were not delivered to us, so all copies were brought already used. General items to look out for when buying. Turbines, the life of which directly depends on the timing of the oil change in the engine. Intake manifold dampers, if you ignore their poor condition, you can get to the engine overhaul. Fuel injectors are expensive, but on early modifications they are subject to restoration. Approaching diesel problems cannot be determined without high quality and, accordingly, expensive diagnostics. But if you manage to find a decent copy, especially a 3 liter one, you can save on fuel without losing dynamics. Although the average annual price tag for servicing a diesel BMW is still higher than a gasoline one. Gearboxes 5-speed mechanics usually do not fail. According to the regulations, it is not necessary to change the oil in it, but if the mileage is over 200,000 kilometers, then such a procedure will not be superfluous. The clutch even 4 racers runs 150 plus thousand km, but the dual mass flywheel is at risk. You can't check its condition without removing the box, and a replacement will cost $500 plus. If you choose a BMW 3E46 with an automatic transmission, then look with the German ZF. There are two modifications of them, 5HP19 and reinforced 5HP24. You can check using the VIN number or on a lift. If the previous owner changed the oil on time and did not overheat the box excessively, then up to 250 to 300,000 km you don't have to worry too much about the automatic transmission. Then go through a scheduled MOT with the replacement of worn parts and drive on. The second option is an automatic transmission from GM. In this case, problems occur quite regularly. The oil pump may break, the thermostat in the automatic transmission may be jammed, and the clutches are afraid of heavy loads, especially after 100,000 mileage. A common misconception is that GM boxes were installed only on the E46 from the American market. They can be installed on any Troika of the fourth generation, with any engine. In the back of the E46, there are rare instances with all-wheel drive 9. It is smart, it transfers the moment to the right wheels, and does not add any special problems during operation. But the driving experience can change drastically. The rear gearbox is maintenance-free, so if there are no leaks, then it is better not to touch it. It breaks down very rarely. Suspension myths and legends about a weak suspension in a BMW are confirmed if you drive or 18 wheels with 1 cm high tires and do not slow down on potholes. In other cases, the suspension is quite reliable without pronounced weaknesses. Yes, it is tough, but due to this, the E46i steers perfectly. Moreover, BMW 3 can hardly be called comfortable for anyone other than the driver. The service life also directly depends on the quality of the installed consumables. Their choice is huge, and the most expensive components are not always installed before the sale. On two-wheel drive vehicles, the ball joint does not change separately from the lever. Some bore the seat and put the ball joint from all-wheel drive versions, where it is supplied separately. This does not affect safety and handling, but you can save some money. The drive shaft and rear suspension require constant attention in the form of regular checks. A timely replaced drive boot or gearbox oil seal can save you a lot of money. All suspension elements are changed individually and separately. If the car has a completely killed Hodavka for a long time, then restoration will cost more than it seems. Moreover, there is reason to think about the general attitude of the owner to his car. The most difficult task is to find a well-groomed specimen. Every year there are fewer and fewer of them. It is better to choose a BMW 3E46 with an inline 6 or a 3 liter diesel engine, which has become famous for its reliability. 
just be sure to budget for expensive diagnostics before buying. In some cases, an automatic transmission from ZF will cost less to maintain than a mechanic. GM automatic transmissions, like in-series engines, are best avoided. BMW 3 is bought to drive, not to move. Therefore, the selection process must be approached consciously.